Hi guys, this is Tanya. Thanks for stopping by to my channel. Thanks for showing up, being there, supporting me in all my crafty journey. I want to offer you the opportunity at the moment to like, subscribe, hit that notification button for future videos. I think you'll like something on my channel. I love different, lots of different crafts, lots of different things. Today it's a haul. Today we have a haul. Forgive my dirty fingers. You guys, this is ink. I had a broken pen in my pocket all day long. Didn't even know it. I've got ink all over me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I went to Tuesday morning. Today, I have a friend who uh, just got a job as the store manager there. And he came into my store the other day and he said, hey, we just got in over 400 items in the craft section. You need to come stop by. You know why he came and stopped by to tell me that because he knew I was going to come shopping. You know it. And you know what? Sure enough, he was there today. And he heard me talking in the aisle because I was FaceTiming with Michelle at a uh, Crafty Ruse. And um, I was FaceTiming with her and he's like, ooh, that sounds like Tanya. And you know what he did to me? He pushed out a full buggy of craft supplies and said, here, I haven't had a chance to go through this yet. You're welcome to it. And you know I went through that basket. You know I did. I had to. I had to. I had to help my friend. I had to. I had to shop. You know, I'm helping him out. I'm buying stuff. I'm helping him, you know, remove some of that old inventory from his from his department and 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 create space for more sales. So it's a win-win. And that's my story. I'm sticking to it. I found some goodies. You guys, hang on. You're going to love this. Don't go away because there's some good stuff at the end. Look at this. They had Tim Holtz. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Because, you know, I need washi tape. Where'd that silver glitter come from? That is not Tim Holtz. Did Tim, Tim, no. Did he put silver glitter in his, really? It's taped shut. Nobody just stuck that in there. What? These were $4.99, and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight rolls in this one, and I think there's six rolls in this one. All different. Gorgeous. I love this one. Look, it looks like the old ledger or the old writing paper when we were in elementary school that we learned how to write cursive on. These are awesome. I love the blue. These are neat. Aren't they fun? Design tape. Woo, woo. Okay, so... Um, yeah, super cool. I'm kind of looking to see if there's like a date on them. 2017, 2018. So these are older ones. I don't care. They were only $4.99. They were $10. $10. So yay. Very, very cool find. I'm going to be sharing some of these finds as well. All right. I got a couple of these. I think I... Did I get two? I feel like I got a third one. I probably, I think I got a third one. So I got one for myself, one for Michelle, and I got one to give away. Doesn't this just scream pastel Christmas? I think it does. Look at this house. Isn't that cute? There's a die cut for the Santa, but the rest are just rubber stamps, which is perfectly fine. $2.99. What? Can't beat that. So super cute, right? What a fun find. So I got a few of those. I got two of these packs of stickers. Really cute. These will be great on tags or, you know, Christmas something, Christmas card. It says from Santa. All the tiny detail on these stickers, Jolie's. I love Jolie's stickers anyway. Really good price, $2.99. I think so. And I got some chipboard stickers. This is Casey, is it called Casey Company? K and Company, I'm sorry. These are so cute. Look at the little robot. These were only $2.99 as well. There's 15 pieces in there. Pine cones, presents, dollies. These will be fun to use as well. I think these would go good. If I remember correctly, I think the Stamperia, um, they might actually work well with that. I'll have to get out my Christmas papers and see. I haven't had them all out yet. I found some, he came out walking with these. He goes, I think this is all the paper I have in the back to throw it in my cart. So there's three tablets of, what is this? Eight by six, I think. Is that how big these are? I think so, six by six would be a square. So these are eight by six. 
And these are fun. So I'm gonna have one of these for a giveaway too. I'm not doing the giveaway yet, but stay tuned because I'm gonna think of something fun. You know I will. But let's open this up and check it out. I'm starting to step, um, put stuff aside, but these were only $2.99 for these. Isn't that great? And I love the prints. Look at that. Some stripes, some wallpapery stuff. Love that. Ooh, that one kind of gives me a, my eyes out of focus. <laughs> That's fun. Fun. That's tiny, tiny music notes. Hard to see, but it's cute. Love the plaid. Not, oh my gosh, you know what? This goes with, um, okay, I'll show you guys in a minute. These are gorgeous together. I love that. That's going to be pretty. I got the big paper. I'll show you guys. And that's what I was thinking. And I got that one. That's music notes as well. More poinsettias. And then we start over. Very, very cute. Very, very cute. So what I've paused about is I actually got a couple of larger paper, 12 by 12s. Let me show you those. I got this one. I don't think this is the same. Is this the same company? No, that's Bow Bunny. This is crepe paper. And it's got ledger on the back, which I thought was really fun. And I'm curious if this is cardstock or paper. It says pattern paper, but that doesn't mean anything to me. It's actually nice, stiff cardstock. That's awesome. So we've got that. But the one that made me pause was this one, which is also Bo Bunny. So it's the same. So it's the same company. So it's the same patterns. So I got an eight by eight, but then I got a pack of this one too. See, it's there. They don't show the blue on this one, but it was in there. I saw it. See this one there? I saw it. There it is. Just like this other side. So that's kind of cool. Didn't even realize that. So, yep, yeah, got some of that. And then, I'm going to save that one. I'm going to save that one. I found these are good deals, right? For $3.99 for this paper. There's probably, I'm guessing, maybe 20 sheets in there, 25 maybe. It doesn't tell me, but I'm guessing. I know there's more than 10. I found these on, on clearance. My camera's getting tall, or isn't it? Probably hard to see. These were only $4.50 for these, and these will be fun to use for uh, Happy Mail or prizes or storage of my own. I don't need more storage. I just <laughs> kind of got them because they were on sale and I thought they'd be fun to uh, give away. But they could be could be fun for my storage. And then I found, look at this, they had a crocodile. I have been looking for something with different edges and I've been looking for these. This was $19.99 and it says estimated value $36.99 or $38.99. I don't know, they were super expensive. That's why I haven't bought one yet. But for $20, I went ahead and grabbed it. And it's got these awesome corners on it. So I'm extremely excited for this find. Love that. Because I've been wanting something different for my edges and my, my borders. So yay. There's the other one. I've got this die, which would be like for tickets. Thought that would be fun. I got Michelle one too. And then I got this one with the dandelions. I don't have this one yet. I love it. Thought that was fun. These are regular $14.99 down to $6.99. Do these have dates on them too? They probably do. 2021, so that's not that far back. How about these? 2021. I, love that. I was like, what can we do with these, Michelle? She said, Tanya, they're tickets. All sizes of tickets. I'm like, oh, you're right. Now, if I just took a scissors, my decorative scissors, and did the chumpy chumpy at the end, it'd be perfect ticket. And then I found this one with a little hummingbird and the embossing folder. I'm going to make a special project with this one, and then I'm probably going to send it with Michelle. I know hummingbirds are special to her. And then I got these quilters blocks. And did I get two of those? Or two? 
if I got two of those or just one. Then I got some um, some recipe cards for my journal. Those were $3.99. I only found one pack. And then they had these inks, you guys. Have you guys used these Javen Davenport inks? If anybody has, can you please tell me how you use them? I mean, they're $3.99, so really not expensive at all um, for a bottle of ink like this. I mean, it's full. It's a, it's a fluid ounce. But I'd love to know how you guys used them. I got the, the cherry color because I thought for Christmas it would be a great color. Um, and it says, how does it say? Use it as it is or dilute it with water for varied effects. Use straight from the bottle or fill ink brush, dauber, mister, or fine line bottles. You, you can use it in their incredible fountain pen. Refill your mermaid markers. I don't know. I'm going to play with it and see what I can come up with, but I'm, I'm curious um, if you guys have used it, what you think of it, how you used it. I'll be uh, playing with it, but um, I'm going to also do some videos or look around at YouTube and see if uh, anybody else has any fun ideas, but I got that to try. I thought it was inexpensive. They come in really bright colors, which is fun. Uh, um, if they had a Christmas green, I'd have got that one too, but the only, the only Christmassy color, traditional Christmassy color, I should say, was the red. So I did grab that one to play with. And then, last but not least, you guys, I was so excited. Call me silly because I know these are the old. I know these are old. These are probably outdated and you're all probably de-stashing them. But I found Garden Party. What? I found Garden Party. They had Garden Party. And they had two, exactly two. Neither Michelle or I have this set. So I got one for each of us. And I am thrilled. I'm so excited. So, I mean, I have Market, and I have, um, I think that's it, really. I think I have some random sheets from some others, but I got Garden Party. Looky, looky. For $6.99. So, you guys, check out your Tuesday morning. So, I um, asked my friend Jay about Tuesday morning and how they work that, and asked him if they can order this stuff in, or if it's just you know, distroed out to them. It is all distroed out to them. So he can see like a category when he looks at his orders, he can see a category of things coming in. Like all this stuff would be under the paper title. And he can see that he had over 400 pieces. And that could be die cuts, that could be inks, that could be paper, that could be Christmas stuff. That could be all crafting is included under that that heading. So he can see what, he can see that he's got a lot coming in, but he can't see what it is. So that was kind of fun. It's kind of like Christmas when he opens up the boxes and sees. But he said that um, all the stores are like that and they all should be getting a lot of the same things. So check out your Tuesday morning. You guys, they do sell out pretty quick because he just told me about this the other day and I didn't see a ton. He told me that they had a whole bunch of Tim Holtz stuff and this lady came in with her cart and bought most of it. So um, there were a few things left for Tim Holtz, but like the uh, little, little glass vial with the cork top on it that was they're about this big and there's three to a pack they had those um they had more washi tapes but I only grabbed two I don't really need more than that I don't need any washi tape but um I did grab some um and I didn't know what to do with the vials I didn't really have an idea when I saw them so I'd left them there I, I probably should have grabbed some but I can't see just putting it in my in my cart without an idea so um Anyway, so this was my haul for today. So Tuesday morning, go check them out. Um, a lot of fun. $6.99 for these pads of paper, you guys. The, the Maggie Holmes paper, I told him he needs to call me when he knows that those orders are coming in because he knows I'm going to fill up my cart. Um, <laughs> I wish he could order some of it um, individually for me, but he can't. So that's okay. Anyways, go check out your, your Tuesday morning. Stay tuned. Talk to them and find out when their shipments are coming in because that's a good way to do it. They may not know what's in that shipment, but maybe they'd be willing to know if you're going to if you're wanting to buy their the stuff, make friends with their their staff there. Maybe they'll give you a call when they're expecting it in and you can get there first. He actually pushed that card out for me. I can't believe he did that. But I, when I was done, I was like, "Hey, you you got another cart back there?" <laughs> and he brought out a few more Christmas things. So, you know, I'll take it. Anyway, you guys, thanks for hanging out with me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I really, really appreciate all of you, um, all of my friends, all of my, everybody that stops by and spends time with me to, every day. It, it just means the world to me. And um, it really brightens my day. So thank you so much for being a part of this journey with me. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. 
I will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.